from Channel 3, this is an Eyewitness News Update. Hi everyone, I'm Kara Sundland. Here are some of the stories that are making news today on Channel 3 Eyewitness News. We're talking about the brutal heat. It's uh, really forcing some restaurants to close for the next couple of days until all this hot weather passes. Among them, J. Timothy's Tavern in Plainville, which will now be serving a limit, limited takeout menu to give its kitchen staff a break. We're going to rotate people in and out, just doing primarily takeout orders to go, rotating fellows in and off the line. A frightening scene inside an area shopping mall last night. Shots rang out near the Macy's store at the Danbury Fair Mall. Shoppers and employees ran to escape danger. A 16-year-old girl was struck in the chest by a bullet. Police believe she was not the intended target. She was alert and conscious when she was taken to the hospital. Police believe a group of people got into a fight and then someone pulled a gun and fired a shot. The search for a suspect continues. Manchester police found guns and drugs while executing a search warrant at the hotel this morning, at a hotel this morning, uh, while they were on the scene. A cruiser was actually hit by another stolen car. It all happened on Spencer Street in Manchester. Police say they did arrest two people in connection with the search warrant. But unrelated to that, they say two people saw the police on the scene and then took off. One got into an Audi and hit a police cruiser on the way out. Thankfully, the officer was not injured. Police later found that the car was stolen from Tolland and it was found this morning in Weathersfield with a lot of damage. Very tough conditions out there today. Have excessive heat warnings in effect, and they will more than likely be in effect for tomorrow as well as those heat index values get up to 100, 105. That's going to be possible for today and also possible for tomorrow. So for older folks or for people that have to spend a lot of time outside today, want to be taking measures to keep yourselves cool today, whether it's the AC, definitely drinking water. That's the bare minimum. Uh, with the humidity, it just it makes it really tough for your body to cool itself down naturally. So uh, we are in this for a couple of rough days with the heat. Once we get towards tonight, there's going to be a chance of a thunderstorm in western or northern Connecticut. You can see how this model's barely doing anything. So uh, the model's struggling to give us anything. And uh, honestly, Honestly, a thunderstorm would be kind of nice to cool us down, but it looks like we may strike out. But there is a chance today and also a chance for tomorrow as well for one of those thunderstorms. Temperatures are going to be just shy of 100 degrees for today. Hartford up to 98 degrees and our temperatures get a lot better early next week. So really looking forward to after we get through this upcoming weekend forecast.